Charles Barkley, the round mound of reboundor Sir Charles. Basketball and the NBA just wouldn't be the same if it hadn't experienced the roller coaster ride of Charles Barkley. Over his career, he has had many defining moments, both bright and dark, at times controversial and at other times rolling on the ground funny. Barkley's antics are simply unforgettable. Let's take a look at some of his best moments. Biography Born on February 20, 1963, in Leeds, Alabama, Charles Barkley grew up in a small town environment that shaped his resilient character. Despite his initial exclusion from the varsity team due to his height, Charles demonstrated an unmatched determination that saw him not only make the team later but also become its star player. His senior year performances earned him a scholarship to Auburn University, where he continued to defy expectations. Known for his powerful plays and less than prototypical basketball physique, Barkley quickly distinguished himself with his ability to score and rebound, earning him the nickname the Round Mound of Rebound. NBA Career Stats Charles Barkley entered the NBA in 1984, drafted by the Philadelphia 76ers as the fifth overall pick. Over his 16-year NBA career including successful tenures with the Philadelphia 76ers, Phoenix Suns, and Houston Rockets, Barkley established himself as one of the league's most dominant power forwards. His career statistics are testament to his impact on the court. He amassed a total of 23,757 points, averaging 22.1 points per game, 12,546 rebounds, averaging 11.7 per game, and 4,215 assists. His most notable season came in 1992-1993 with the Phoenix Suns where he was awarded the NBA Most Valuable Player MVP, and led the team to the NBA Finals. From the court to the commentary booth After retiring from professional basketball in 2000, Charles Barkley transitioned into a successful career as a television sports analyst. As a mainstay on TNT's Inside the NBA, Barkley is celebrated for his unfiltered, humorous, and insightful commentary that often bridges sports and social issues. His post-NBA life has also been marked by his candid public presence and philanthropy. He has been vocal in his support for various causes, contributing millions to charities and educational institutions. Barkley's commitment to giving back to the community reflects his understanding of his platform and his desire to effect positive change. Let's take a look at some of the best moments from his career. Winning the rebounding title, 1986-87. Charles Barkley's entry into the NBA was marked by immediate impact, thanks to his robust play and vibrant personality. By the 1986-87 season, Barkley had fully emerged as the Philadelphia 76ers' most influential player, especially after the departure of Moses Malone and the retirement of Julius Irving. That season, Barkley not only led the team in scoring but also secured the NBA rebounding title, an impressive feat considering his relatively modest height for a forward. He averaged 23 points and topped the league in rebounds, showcasing his exceptional ability to outplay taller and bigger opponents under the basket. This achievement underscored Barkley's unique talents and his knack for maximizing his physical abilities to dominate the game. Honoring a Living Legend 1991-92 The 1991-92 NBA season was marked by an event that shook the basketball world. Magic Johnson, the Los Angeles Lakers superstar and a beloved figure in sports, made a shocking announcement. He had tested positive for HIV and would retire immediately. This news was unprecedented and stirred a variety of reactions across the league. While some players expressed concerns about playing against him, Charles Barkley stood out as a staunch supporter. In a powerful gesture of solidarity, Barkley wore Johnson's No. 32 jersey throughout his final season with the Philadelphia 76ers. His defense of Johnson extended beyond the jersey. Barkley vocally supported his friend and teammate on the Dream Team, emphasizing that basketball was just a game and their interactions did not pose health risks. Barkley's actions highlighted not only his loyalty but also helped challenge the stigma associated with HIV at the time. Barkley Goes West, 1992-93 After spending eight fruitful seasons with the Philadelphia 76ers, Charles Barkley was traded to the Phoenix Suns before the 1992-93 season. This move marked a new chapter in his career, and he quickly took up the mantle of team leader. In his debut season with the Suns, Barkley was phenomenal, averaging 25.6 points and 12.2 rebounds per game. His outstanding performance throughout the season 
earned him the most valuable player award. More importantly, he led the Suns all the way to the NBA Finals, where they faced off against Michael Jordan and the Chicago Bulls. Although the Suns did not win the championship, Barkley's leadership and dominant play throughout the season were instrumental in their successful campaign. Supersonic showing in Game 7, 1993 Following his MVP-winning season in 1992-93, Charles Barkley entered the playoffs with high expectations. The Phoenix Suns had performed well, but found themselves in a tough series against the Seattle Supersonics in the Western Conference Finals. The series extended to a decisive seventh game, where Barkley delivered an unforgettable performance. He scored 44 points and grabbed 24 rebounds, including a crucial 10 offensive boards in a game that clinched the series with the Suns. This victory was pivotal, sending the Suns to the NBA Finals for the first time since 1976. Barkley's extraordinary effort in Game 7 was a showcase of his leadership and clutch play, underlining his status as one of the greats of the game. A golden performance in Game 3, 1994. Despite battling injuries throughout the 1993-94 season, Charles Barkley's resolve and skill were on full display during the playoffs. In a critical Game 3 against the Golden State Warriors, Barkley delivered one of the most remarkable performances in NBA postseason history. Scoring a whopping 56 points on incredibly efficient shooting, 23 of 31 from the field, Barkley dominated the game in every facet. He also contributed 14 rebounds, 4 assists, 3 steals and a block, playing 41 minutes of high-intensity basketball. This performance not only highlighted his scoring ability but also his all-around game, proving that even injuries could not diminish his impact on the court. Standing up to Superman, 1999 in the late 1990s, the Los Angeles Lakers were poised to dominate the NBA under the leadership of Shaquille O'Neal, one of the most dominant players ever seen in the league. Known as Diesel for his powerful physique and formidable presence on the court, O'Neal was a player that few dared to confront. However, Charles Barkley, known for his fearless and competitive nature, did not shy away from a challenge. In a memorable game on November 10, 1999, Barkley faced O'Neal head-on. After O'Neal blocked a layup attempt and pushed Barkley, Charles immediately retaliated by throwing the ball at him, sparking a scuffle that saw both players fall to the ground. This confrontation was not just about that moment, but was a testament to Barkley's refusal to be intimidated by anyone, showcasing his indomitable spirit and resilience.